the Rhode Island Foundation recently released a video. In it, they have children reading Twitter tweets from the internet. Let's listen in. What a When I see her face, I get annoyed. I'm such a piece of shit. I hope someone cuts his brakes. They are animals in South Providence? They are dumber than dog scat all day, every day? Who says this? The purpose of the video seems to be a call for Rhode Islanders to be more positive about their government and their elected officials, or to simply stop commenting. Instead of children using profanity to get a point across. We have some other ideas to help Rhode Islanders feel positive. Stop complaining, blaming, trolling, really? First you stop burdening, ignoring, and financially abusing us. If I start complaining and blaming you about truck tolls, there's a reason for that. We didn't need them, we didn't want them, but you did, so we got them. One day, it's prostitution in the state house, the next, it's a councilman stealing from children, and the next, it's reps that don't live where they say they do, and you want us to stop complaining? Really? Here's what I think. When Rhode Island's elected officials start acting like they understand that they work for the people who voted for them, then we will be able to offer much more uplifting annual performance reviews than we can today. Don't put kids in front of the camera again. It's your turn to show us a little respect.